And welcome back, everybody, to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're going to pick up right where we left off and continue on our adventure here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's do it. Okay, so we're going into a, a cave. It's perfectly safe in these caves. Nothing could possibly go wrong in here. It is badass looking in here, though. Turbine facility. Hmm. Let's just kind of look around a little bit before we decide on which direction to go. So we've got a, a climbable wall to get across there. We're not going to be able to make it up there. And we can also jump across that way. I'm not the only old gamer. Everybody, welcome, my friend, Sal Old Gamer. It's good to see you, man. Hey, Sal, what's going on, bud? Welcome, man. And then we can also go off this way. All right, well, uh, I guess this probably this doesn't tell us anything, does it? We can't we can't read um, imperial vocabulary, phonics, whatever. All right, let's go this way. Hmm. Okay. Found something. My friend, in the rotation since I left Pagano, I've uncovered more about the Zepho than I once believed possible. Okay. So <clears throat> that's our our uh, Jedi Master guy who's kind of guiding us uh, to another test we have to take so that we can get a hold of a thingamadoodle called a uh, holocron which contains names of future Jedi that's kind of why we're here in this uh, on this world doors locked from the other side of course it is of course it is goodness hey Sal how are you buddy I hope your day is going good um, I think, too, if we go here... Somewhere we're supposed to look up information about... Yeah, that was from uh, Bagana. Second sister, ninth sister, other characters, prof. Cordova's journey. Oh yeah, this is this is where we need to go. So, uh, the sages. Yeah, this is the one that we just uncovered. Okay, my friend, in the rotation since I left Pagano, I've uncovered more about the Zepho than I once believed possible. This planet, their homeworld, has been a revelation. It appears many, yet not all, the Zepho could wield the Force. They called it the Life Wind, and those who wielded it, sages. Three names appear with frequency. Um, Ilrim Mitrol Kujet. It seems these sages held esteemed positions within their culture. I've informed the council to lukewarm reception. They have become too focused on Jedi history, but the history of the Force belongs to us all. All right, cool. We already read all of these in earlier, um, earlier episodes, so we should be good to go. Okay, let's go back this way. Oh, he's still balancing. <laughs> I didn't see another way we could go over there, so I'm assuming we have to come this way now. All 
Alright, let's go this direction. There's a chest over there. New lightsaber material acquired. Nice. One of the things I remember about playing the, the Jedi Outcast games in the early 2000s is just, you know, just the levels and some of the places that game took you were pretty, pretty awesome, you know. And you know that was a, that was back in early 2000s too. The graphics were nowhere near as good as this and all that. But I just really remember enjoying those games thoroughly. And they had a they had a really fun multiplayer. Uh, you know, land we'd get together and have land parties. So me and my kids and my friends and we'd light try and lightsaber each other and stuff. It was a lot of fun. Okay, interact. Hey, they turned the lights on. All right. Awesome. But this game so far has not disappointed in the levels either. It's pretty pretty damn cool. Alright, so we're way out here now. Cool. Oh! We got a guy. Jedi. Oh shit! Wasn't expecting that. You little bastard. Just for that, you get cut in half. Oh, uh oh. Holy crap, how do we, how do we do this? <laughs> Shit. Um. Hmm. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait until it's level. And then we're gonna run forward and I guess jump up on top of the... the motor? Why the hell didn't they give us a save point right here? Damn. Okay. Yeah, I think that's what we have to do. We're gonna have to jump on top of the motor after we slow it. Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, good, good, we start here. Okay, we start here. Uh, I, I hit the slow thing a little too, too late, I think. Okay, so we gotta time this just right. And boom! Hurry, hurry, hurry! Wah! Okay, we got this. Okay, so we can stand here. Oh, no, no, not there. I gotta see... Okay, right now. Oh, my God. Whew. Okay, we got this. That looks like a problem. What looks like a problem? Oh, yeah, that does... Oh, shit! That does look like a problem. Um... Well, we can do that to him. Ah! Okay. Whew, okay. I'll check it out. I'm look a flock. When provoked, Falak's low vision makes it difficult to change course, often crashing into rocks when charging. Falak hooves adapted to keep, uh, yeah, to keep them steady in mountain passes, making them 
resistant to the push and pull of Zepho's high winds. Flocks are masterful climbers, able to move with the ease on mountain paths. Solitary by nature, they leave their mother's side early to find their own territory. Their horns on their heads are their greatest weapon. When the two flocks, when two flocks clash, they sound thunders across the mountains. As they age, their horns steadily grow, adding a new ring for each year of their lives. Interesting. Okay. Cool. Okay. That was kind of a kind of um, cruel of the game, though, to throw that at us right, <laughs> right after we made it over that thing. Okay. Hopefully we get a save point here pretty soon. I don't want to have another run-in with a falak without one. Oh my goodness, what's going on over here? Interesting. I wonder what the hell that stuff is. New objective added in the hollow map. Seek the eye of the storm. Okay. Well, let's see. We're at half health. We probably better play it safe here. And uh, we just got to be careful that we don't get the blaster guys coming after us at the same time that these guys come after us. It's reducing the quality of my posture and aim. Doesn't surprise me. Rations at this posting are terrible. I'm just saying it's not my fault if I miss a target. I don't... Those guys are probably too far away for me to... Oh shit, that's guy that guy's got a rocket launcher. I don't think I can bounce that back at him. What's he doing? Ah. Quick, catch him. Hmm. How do we deal with that? I'm pretty sure if I try and bounce that back with my lightsaber, it's just gonna explode in my face. Okay, he's not shooting at me. Reach him. This one's mine. That's a whole lot of trouble right down there too, isn't it? Okay, um boy. You wanna handle this? What do we do here? We don't even have to try here. What we might need to do is is jump down there. How do we get to him? And run really quickly, run up to the cliff uh, below him, so so the rocket guy can't hit us, and then deal with these guys. Whoa! What the hell's that? Oh okay. look! He's scared. He's, he's mine. Ah. I can't reach him. Okay. Well, that wasn't super eloquent, but oh shit! We got to do this again. All right. Well, we know how to do it. We just have to time it right, is all. Execute the intruder. Um, I don't know if I want to take four of those guys on in close quarters, with no save point in sight. I mean, they'll give us XP, but that's kind of risky. Did we scare you? Yeah. Let's 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 let them live another day. Oh no, look at this. <laughs> we got to get up there. Okay. So now. Woo! Ah! Oh boy. Okay. So that's going to drop. Hmm. I'm just trying to think in my brain what the timing of this is going to be. So we're going to jump on that. It's going to start to drop. And we want to... We want the far, you know, turbine to be somewhat level by the time that happens. So I'm thinking... Maybe we run up there right when that the far turbine's about vertical. Oh my goodness. Okay. Here we go. Whew, okay. 
This is intense. Oh, okay. We got this. Bang! Oh, wow, check that out. Wonder what those things are. Huh. We're pro whoa. We're probably gonna find whoa. out. That's gotta be one of the Zepho. Guess we're on the right track, huh, BD? Oh boy. Enemy, look up. I, I can't get him. That's a I lot of blaster him. bolts coming at the same time. Keep your distance. Okay. Get up here. Hurry. Okay, shoot. Okay. Shoot, 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 shoot. Why aren't you shooting? All right, don't shoot then. All right, what do we got over here? Shortcut, all right. Shortcut to where exactly? Right, okay, so yeah, this is where we um, got that next message from uh, the Jedi Master guy. There's not a save point in here, though, is a thing. Hmm, alright, well, let's keep going. Hopefully we'll come across one here soon. Ooh, we're gonna s oh shit, we're gonna slide down here and then we're gonna have to jump with that guy shooting at us. Oh! Jedi. <laughs> All right. yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. Phew. I was afraid we were going to go off a cliff or something. Dang! This is crazy, you guys. Okay, here we go. Why couldn't I have a save point like right here? We're going to have to deal with two of those rat dudes down there. Weathered Monument. Get him. Come at me, bro. You have to deal with me now, Jedi. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Oh, man, this is so cool. All right, let's see. Let's go over here. S comp link must be repaired. Okay, well, hopefully they'll tell us what that means and how to do it at some point. Ah, 
I feel a secret coming on. Or a save point. That's good too. Sense echo. There, Hannah. Take care of us. What the hell? Little bastard. He shouldn't attack a guy when he's drinking his tea. Damn. All right. Uh, what was this? Dead villager. The remains of a villager who died trying to save his family from the Empire. That sucks. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. All right. So, do we go left? Or do we go right? Left or right? It almost looks to me like... I can't push it. All right. So... It marked the location for us. Oh, there's a save point. Okay. All right. Awesome. We're making good progress here, and we got a skill point, too. Let's go ahead and rest. Actually, I should have done the skill point first, but that's okay. What do we got? What do we got? I want force push, man. Um... So what's this do? Superior blocking. Cal's defenses are improved, allowing him to take less block stamina damage from incoming attacks. Okay, so there's that. And then we've got um, dash strike. Cal dashes forward and attacks his target. Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. We do that by holding F. Or Cal can perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. So we hit F twice. What's this one? Attacking after a quick evade allows Cal to quickly perform a kick attack. So we need to dodge and then hit the mouse button. Attacking out of a sprint allows Cal to perform a special lightsaber attack. Huh. Okay. All of those sound fun. It's just a matter of, you know, which one do we want to do next? That could be that could be good. Uh, attacking after a quick evade, so after we dodge, that could be good too. Man, they're all good. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead. Cal's fists are improved, allowing him to take less block stamina damage from incoming attacks. Jumping over the target would be good. Uh, let's try... I kind of like the idea of this dodge one. So we dodge and then we attack and he'll do a special kind of thingamadoodle. So let's do that one. Oh, 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 right. We can't get to it yet until we do this one first. Okay, well, I guess we don't have a choice then for that particular tree. Oh, okay, so when he jumps over him... <laughs> he whacks him in the face in the, in the process. Okay, yeah, we'll have to try that. Fun, fun. <laughs> the joke in the droid's name. I thought about doing that, Common, uh, about having the Rocket Man blow the group up, but I didn't really trust in my skills enough to do that without getting myself blown up in the process. 
Okay, so let's see. We came down that way. I don't think we can get up to there. Yeah, it's a little too high. So we can go this style. Oh, shit. What the hell is that? Seriously? If Cal runs out of block stamina, he will be temporarily stopped. Oh, not good. Maybe we should have taken that block stamina win. Um. Okay. You made a mistake coming here. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> that was my new move, man. That was awesome. What's that? Yeah, he, he said, what's that, too? Heavy Assault Trooper. Shielded, heavy, long-range, rapid-fire weapon capable of sustaining numerous hits. Slow movement, long wind-up before firing in a cool-down period after attack, providing opportunities to attack. The Heavy Assault Troopers are specialized infantry serving the Galactic Empire on the front lines of war. They are prim primarily trained to defend combat zones as support squads to Stormtrooper patrols. They are highly proficient with the Z6 Rotary Blaster Cannon, which fires off steady, rapid, long-range bursts capable of inflicting heavy damage and shielded by a low emitter energy rate. In other words, it's a laser gatling. Thanks okay. for the help. Hmm. Okay, so the question now is, do we keep going this way? Because there was another route... Um, down there, that where those guys were standing, that we could have gone to. Let's consult our what the hell was that? Let's consult consult our map here. Okay, so I guess we'll stay on this path for now and just kind of you know see if if we come back through that way. Since we're already over here. You're not getting out of here alone. Oh crap. Seriously? Um Okay, so, how are we going to play this? Um... I guess we balance and block until we get over to him. We just have to make sure we don't run out of, um... stamina while we're doing it, so... Okay, let's go. I'll break your guard. Whew, okay. <laughs> I can't hear you through my busted eardrum. Is that what he said? We're not going to be able to open that until we get an S Comp link repaired. Game hasn't told us how we do that yet. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking. I'm thinking we need Let's to go, go back, one. because we missed that cave. There's probably something important in that cave. So let's do it. As long as we don't... As long as we don't, um... You know, meditate again. We won't get, uh... Enemy repops. See, it's that cave right there that I want to go in. Running scared. I hope we survive this. Take him down. Get up here. Hurry. Oh, yeah. 
Stepping away. That guy was tough. You want us to scan something? Oh, uh, I saw a scan thing in my doodle pop up for a second there, but now I don't see it, so. Hmm. Alright, let's go in here. Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. That can't be good. Awesome. Send Sekro. Villager was wounded, but he took out a trooper. Evidence of a fight. A stormtrooper helmet left after a struggle with a villager. Okay. Uh, we got a new point, too. Um... Oh, okay. Uh, subtitles. Yeah, we can turn subtitles on. I don't have those off deliberately. Uh, where would we do that at? Probably gameplay? Subtitles. There you go. Oh, there goes the timer. Yeah, no no problem, dude. I didn't, I didn't even know that... I hadn't considered that we even had those. I actually like subtitles, too, because sometimes you miss stuff, you know... Uh, when you're listening. All right, guys. Well, uh, we are out of time here, so we're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here, and we'll just pick up again uh, right where we left off. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.